welcome to another tutorials now video in this video i'll be showing you how to install gcc compiler on windows so what is min gw min gw is a port of gcc to windows it was created to support the gcc compiler on windows platform it let us to access the headers and support libraries on windows it produces standalone windows executable which may be distributed in any manner go to mingw.org and click on the download installer button in the top right corner it will take you to source fork for downloading After the download, run the setup as administrator. Click on install. It is going to be installed in C min gw folder. Click on continue. Then it will fetch and update its database from the server. Click on the continue button when it becomes clickable. It will be on the basic setup tab by default. They look for min gw32 gcc g++. Right click and mark for installation. Now, click on the installation menu and hit apply changes. Then it will open the confirmation dialog box. There click on apply. It will start downloading the required files. Once the download gets completed, it will install the packages. Click on close to finish the setup. In order to check whether it has installed correctly or not, you have to go to C min gw bin folder. There, holding the shift key, right click on the empty area, click on open command window here. In the command prompt, type the command gcc hyphen v. It will show the version of gcc installed on your computer. If the output doesn't look similar as this one, then there will be some problem in your installation. Now we are going to see how to set the environment variable. The purpose of setting the environment variable is to access the gcc command everywhere in the command prompt. Setting up the environment variable will tell the system where to look for the gcc command. Copy the c min gw bin path and click on this pc. Now right click on the empty area and click on properties. There choose advanced system settings. It will open the system properties dialog box. There click on the environment variables. In the system variables section, look for path and click on edit. Append the path C min gw bin in the variable value and click on OK. That's all, now you have successfully configured the GCC compiler on your computer. Now we are going to create a sample C program. To check whether the GCC compiler is working correctly or not, right click, click on new, text document, rename it to sample.c. Then right click on it and open it in your favorite text editor. 
I am writing a sample C program here. This is a sample C program. Save it. Now, right click on the Windows icon and click on Command Prompt. Navigate to the folder where you have created the sample.c file. Then, type the command gcc sample.c. It will create an executable file named a.exe. Type a.exe in the command prompt. Here's the output. Now we have successfully installed GCC compiler on Windows. Subscribe to this channel for more videos.